How's everybody? Doing all right? Back to school? Everybody having fun so far? Yeah. <laughs> good, good answer. Good answer. So tell us a little bit, I guess, about what you guys are covering right now. Right now we're learning about vectors. So basically how to find the distance in between two points and like what speeds they're going. So I have to find out how far my house is from his house. So we have to use the Pythagorean theorem to find the in-between there. Some of you go to college after you leave here. Maybe some of you go to the trades. But I'm telling you, there'll be opportunity once you leave this. You're going to have choices is what I'm saying. How are you today? Very nice to meet you. Very nice to meet you. Welcome to biomedical science class. Okay, that sounds awful important. I can tell you that right now. This is more of our engineering side of our Project Lead the Way okay. classrooms. So. That's another issue that's about as hot as you can be right now on the outside. Everybody's looking for engineers. All right, so okay, you got to explain it to me as you go, okay? All right, so what we're doing right now is, so this is, we're answering a couple of questions about this single, this fixed pulley here. So what we're doing is we're trying to find the ideal mechanical advantage. So what are you going to use that for someday? Um, well, this can be used, say, for like a crane or something like that. If you need to lift up metal metal beams or anything like that, it can help you calculate, make sure it like, won't tip over, yeah. the beam is too heavy, yeah. make sure you can lift it up. So. Yeah. so you know one of the highest demand jobs in the state of Missouri right now? Uh, Engineering. The highest demand. You can about write your own ticket right now. If you, if you <laughs> get through here and you get through college, I am telling you, Kansas here, City. Yeah, oh yeah, that's, well you can't leave Missouri. I've got an order in place that says you can't go, you can't go outside of there. I want I you to stay here. <laughs> I don't want to interrupt class too much. I don't want to interrupt anything, but I just really want to come by and say hello to you students. Uh, appreciate what you're doing every day up here, and I appreciate the administration and the school system. You're uh, without a doubt in one of the better schools uh, in, in this area, so don't take that lightly. Um, Governor Parson, I want to welcome you uh, and your entire team uh, to not only the Rockwood School District, but here at Marquette High School. We are pleased to have you here today, and Dr. Van even as well. And, and I also want to thank uh, Dr. Kane, probably one of the most highly recognized superintendents uh, in, in the state, uh, on the national level and the state level. And there's one thing I've learned from being around a little while, those type of uh, recognition Nobody just gives that to you. You gotta earn that. And the impression I had today as I walked in these classrooms and I walked in here today was nothing but a positive impression. And that goes credit to a lot of people in this room. It really goes credit to you students. 